Hey everyone, so I'm just going to do a quick uh, video on the kinds of things I normally carry with me when I go uh, overseas or when I travel around uh, out of town. I've seen a couple of videos on this and I thought I might as well share what I normally carry. Uh, obviously it's a combination of things but let me just uh, start off with the typical things which I do. Well the most important thing while traveling is you've got to have a wireless um, you know access point in your hotel room so this is from Apple um, this is their Airport Express uh, and it's pretty damn good uh, obviously you have the option um, to obviously connect directly to the Ethernet socket in the hotel room but uh, what, what this does is you plug in the Ethernet over here and then uh, you configure this for it to become like a router or a wireless access point so this is, uh, this is a very good investment I've had it for a few years Another important thing while traveling, especially overseas, is you need a multi-plug uh, adapter. So this is this is quite a unique one. Uh, there are a couple of different models out there in the market, but this has got all the different uh, connection points which you need. So this is the UK uh, plug. You've got the standard European ones. Uh, you've got the Australian one, and I think you've even got the US ones here. So this is uh, quite nice, and it's. Uh, and it's again something very very handy to have with you while traveling. Obviously on this side you've got the multi uh, holes for the different uh, plug types. Now how can you travel without your cell phone? So this is this is my Blackberry from work which I do have to carry with me uh, even when I'm on holidays. Um, then I've got my lovely iPhone 4. Um, yes so this is something which I can't do without uh, and I have a spare phone uh, which has a SIM card uh, spare SIM card as well uh, so that's quite handy so these three together um, depending on where I go and where I travel uh, it's always a combination of at least two of these Blackberry obviously all the time and either one of these two phones and if I'm going for a long trip then definitely I carry this as well this is the HTC uh, HD2 um, a good phone um, treated me well. Now, uh, while traveling, you always need music, right? So, but I do want to carry big, big, big set of speakers. So, what I've got here is the X Mini. Now, what the X Mini has got is you've got two USB uh, charging ports over here, and you can connect them again through USB. Now, a really good thing about this is the form factor. So, it's got a magnetic base, so it's easy enough. So it sits together and then you split it out so that's that's each one of the speakers and what happens is when you twist them out that releases the bass module and so two together you actually get um, quite a bit of impressive sound enough to fill up fill up your hotel room now one of the things I always like to have with me is my uh, MiFi uh, personal hotspot. So I normally have a 3G data card here, um, and uh, this this is from Huawei. And uh, as you can see, it's one of the new models, uh, and it's and it's very very uh, handy to have this because it allows me to convert, to connect multiple uh, internet devices onto this one little device. Um, it's 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 very unique in nature, obviously, because uh, it's a nice flashy LED design. So as you can see, insert SIM. Once you insert the SIM inside, it gives you about you know about five hours battery life, which is which is quite impressive. And obviously, if you don't want to use the Wi-Fi, use it as a modem. You you have the USB um, ports over here. Now, uh, before I progress any further uh, I, I have this little pack which I, I got from uh, uh, I don't know must have been one of the business class trips I went somewhere uh, anyway so I, I keep this with me and it's got a couple of good goodies in there so this is my 500 GB Western Digital Firewire ready Firewire ready um, drive yeah so uh, that's got the firewire connections in there 
if you can have a look yeah so let's go to firewire connections and let's go to USB now it's 500 GB obviously I use this quite a bit it's got a lot of my music and videos as well as backup documentation which I need um, and it's always handy to have this around so that's that a multiple um, card reader you always need one of these some USB cables um, some more USB cables okay now this is one of my favorites it's a um, 21 Mbps uh, 3G data, data USB uh, modem and uh, it goes very well uh, it gives me very good uh, download speeds you can see it over here is Express 21 uh, this is issued by a telco operator in Hong Kong and uh, I have it on with global data roaming uh, unlimited so this is something so this is what I, I swap my sim card with this around to the router if I need to okay so some USB drives um, yeah so this is the data traveler locker now what's impressive about this particular uh, USB drive is it's got hardware encryption and I'm serious it's got hardware encryption not so much software encryption so if you if you enter the password wrong a certain number of times it formats the entire drive by itself so this is really handy for sensitive documentation I've got a few of these I've got a 4 gig one and I've got a 32 gig one as well always carry a cat 6 cable with me I've got this is one of the ones which is flat not the rounded one so it's easy enough and portable uh, you know, easy enough to bundle it down and sh into a really small footprint and obviously it's it's nice um, and light as well now obviously a spare set of uh, uh, you know cables for the iPhone etc and some cleaning cloth so that's that's really what's uh, in this little compartment now what else a spare set of sunnies well not a spare set really just a set of sunnies um, moleskin to jot down notes there's a new one so there's mo not much written in there but yeah um, I like to read a lot so I've got my favorite Kindle this is uh, the one which came out this year I don't know which model it is but the Kindle DX I think yeah so I've got my Kindle in here uh, it's just the Wi-Fi one not, one not the one with the 3G um, my travel companion so I have all my credit cards and business cards, the sector passport in here. This is from Tumi, so uh, Tumi makes uh, really good stuff. So you should check it out. Now speakers, not speakers, sorry, headphones and earphones. So this is this is uh, the the one from Bose, and the, this is the QC15. The QC15 is by far the best uh, noise cancelling headsets you can ever get. Um, there are a lot of reviews about it on the web, but anyway, I think if you haven't seen them, this is what it, they look like. Um, QC15s, uh, the cables plug in over there, battery over there when you switch it on, noise cancelling comes on, very very good leather plush finish, very soft and very light and solid construction. Um, believe me, if you ever sit on a long flight, you can fall asleep with these even without the music being switched on. Great ones. So you've got that. Now I do have another set of uh, smaller isolating earphones and these are from Shura and I think these are the SC530's top quality earbuds amazing sound quality. I've got the adapter in there as well so that I can it, it, it acts as a mic um, when plugged into my Blackberry or to my iPhone 
uh, had them for over two years, no regrets. Still use them quite a lot, especially if I'm not in the airplane. Um, carry some batteries in here with me, some extra aircraft uh, yeah, um, sockets. So that's really what's in the uh, in the headphone case. So uh, now we're coming down to well, you know, uh, iPad, Notepad. Um, so yeah, I, I do carry this uh, around with me when I go on tour, uh, on work, um, on leisure. So I've always got the iPad with me. I've got my Notepad. This is from Moleskin. Really little handy little thing. Um, now this is where I begin to decide what what laptop I'm going to carry. So if it's a short trip. Uh, MacBook Air, you know, uh, this is the 11.6 inch, the new one. Uh, beautiful, light, and uh, reliable. So I've got this 11 inch one. And if I'm gonna do on a long holiday with my video camera and all that stuff, I might just carry my 17 inch MacBook Pro. So that's uh, this is obviously bit heavier than normal but yeah um, that's that's pretty much what I have now obviously if I go for a work trip I, I do have my work laptop which is a um, ThinkPad 200X or something so you know I hope you you enjoyed uh, this video um, let me just show you one last thing which is the bag in which I put all of this stuff in right so what I've got, and I've got a really nice, sexy bag from Tumi. So Tumi's bag, uh, the reason I like it is because it's a nice big knapsack. Um, a lot of things you can put in them. Um, so as you can see, it's pretty, pretty well laid out. I've got the uh, laptop sleeve, can go up to a 17 inch in there. Uh, I've got a couple of pockets on the side and on, over here so I can put some papers as well as uh, electronics um, it's got some side flaps so which you can either you know put a water bottle or if you are carrying a tripod you can even put, do that in the side um, a small compartment in the front where you can have your pens and all of that stuff uh, another compartment up at the top and this is the part which I like the best, the side compartment. Uh, the side compartment here. And here is where I normally put my passport and my travel folio. So this is a great one. I don't know what the model is, but uh, you, can, you can go on the Tumi website. Now, at the back, it's got the shoulder uh, knapsack straps. And uh, if you just want to carry it around, you've got the carrying uh, stuff handles as well. So that's what I normally put everything in and it fits in quite well. Obviously the bag is a lot lighter in uh, when I use the MacBook Air. Uh, and of course it goes without saying that all the necessary power cables and accessories, power cables at least uh, for whether the laptop or the Kindle or the uh, uh, what's it called, the iPad etc. That all that is a standard thing which goes in. So uh, I hope you guys had a uh, had fun watching this video. Check you guys out later again. Cheers, bye.